good evening, everyone. We are counting down the days until decision day. The general election, a little more than two weeks away, and neighbors in Onondaga County are showing interest in the election and the voting process. News Channel 9's Josh Martin tells us about the hundreds of people signed up to be election inspectors on November 3rd. When you go to the polls, there'll be plenty of people, socially distant, who make sure our election integrity is intact. In recent years here in Onondaga County, the Board of Elections struggled to get around 1,200 inspectors needed for the election. But 2020 has brought new energy and participation. More than 1,700 people took classes to be an inspector this year. Yes, it was an overwhelming amount this year. We've been shy inspectors the quite a few years since the county decided to make Election Day a holiday or not a holiday. We used to have uh, workers from Onondaga County working with us. So we lost a lot of inspectors at that time. But now this year they have come out and we've gotten a lot of requests and we still we have a few extra right now. Using everybody we can and have backups. We need extra people this year because of the COVID uh, um, uh, requirements to make sure that we're cleaning and, and, and uh, staffing uh, and keeping six foot social distances. So that requires extra people to help us out with that. Mm -hmm. uh, so, you know, we're, we're, we're pretty full. Applications for election inspectors ended last week, but the BOE had to extend classes to October to make sure everyone was properly trained. Each polling site in Onondaga County will have the same number of Democrats and Republican inspectors on Election Day. Josh Martin, News Channel 9. And participation in this election is very high in Onondaga County. New records for registered voters and absentee ballots have already been set.